Hello, hello, hello. Oh, hey everyone. In this video, we'll see how Amazon Luna works and how to set it up on a Fire TV stick. First, let's look at what's in the Amazon Luna controller box. Of course, we have the controller itself, which is right here, along with instructions and two batteries to get started. With batteries in the controller, let's go to our Fire TV stick and download the Luna app. Head to the App Store, go to Search and type Luna. In the results, click on Luna and there's the app. Let's open it and install it for free. Once installed, we'll go back to the main menu and connect the controller. To do this, go to the far right to settings and click on controllers and Bluetooth devices. Once there, scroll down and click on game controllers. In the next menu, click add controller. Now first we need to turn on the Amazon Luna controller. To do this, press and hold the central power button for a few seconds. You'll feel the controller vibrate and see the light start spinning orange. For the Fire TV stick to find it, press and hold the action button, the small circle, and the B button at the same time for a few seconds. Doing this will make the light change to flashing bluish white. Once in this mode, your Fire TV stick will detect the Lunar Game Controller. Next, press the center button on your Fire TV stick remote to pair it. As you can see, there it is. The Amazon Fire Game Controller, connected via Bluetooth and ready to use, even to control our Amazon Fire TV stick. Now let's go back to the main menu, open the apps, and launch Luna. As you can see with the Amazon Luna controller, we can enter the app and start browsing games. As you can see, Amazon Prime customers have plenty of games. All these up here are for Amazon Prime members, and below that, we can also purchase games to play directly on our Amazon Fire TV stick. Well folks, that's it for the video. As you can see, we're now streaming Mega Man 11. It's not a resource heavy game, but it's been running smoothly in my time playing. I've experienced some lag, but despite being on Wi-Fi and occasional stutters, the game ran smoothly and was playable without issues. As you've seen, I connected the Luna controller very quickly. It was fast from the moment I started the video to when I connected the controller and started playing on my Amazon Fire TV stick. So, as you can see, we have a cloud gaming system that, if we have a Fire TV stick connected to our TV, can serve as a mini game console right on our smart TV. If this video was helpful, please leave a like, subscribe, and hit the bell to stay updated. That's all from me. As always, it's been a pleasure. See you in the next video.